We're learning more this morning about the police shooting of an unarmed man in South Carolina. It happened during a traffic stop this month. A state trooper is charged with assault. Prosecutors say he acted recklessly. Elaine Kiana looks at what the wounded man's attorney is saying now. Elaine, good morning. Good morning. Trooper Sean Grubert approached Jones at a Columbia, South Carolina gas station for allegedly not wearing his seatbelt. Seconds after asking him for his driver's license, Grubert opened fire. The dash cam video shows the trooper's vehicle approach Jones's SUV at a Shell station on September 4th. Have your license, please. Get out of the car! Get out of the car! Jones was shot in the hip. The 35-year-old was returning home from work Get and was ground. unarmed. Get on the ground! I just got my license. You think you're my license? I got my license. Put your hands behind your back. 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 What did I do, sir? Are you hit? I think so. I can't feel my leg. I don't know what happened. I just grabbed my leg. Rachel on 866. I need a 1052. Why did you why did you shoot me? I think that the video speaks for itself. Trooper Gruber overreacted. Todd Rutherford is LeVar Jones' lawyer. Mr. Jones was only trying to comply with the trooper's orders. He was trying to do what was right, and he tried to explain that several times after the trooper told him why he had shot him. The South Carolina Department of Public Safety immediately opened an investigation into the shooting and last Friday fired the 31-year-old trooper. In a statement, the department said Grubert's actions, quote, rose to such an extent that his employment with us must be terminated and that protocol was not followed in this case. Records indicate he joined the force in 2005, but left in 2009 to work for the Richland County Sheriff's Office. He rejoined the department in 2012. That year, Grubert was involved in a police pursuit following a traffic stop near a bank. The suspect opened fire on police. Grubert wounded the suspect and was awarded a Medal of Valor. Grubert appeared in court Wednesday night and was released on $75,000 bond. Sean Grubert is due back in court again next month. If convicted, he faces 20 years in state prison. LeVar Jones is recovering from his injuries at home and is expected to make a full recovery.